it's Rianne, and today I'm going to be doing a spring break haul. I am super excited for spring break. I can't even tell you. Um, so I went to Target and I went online um, to Shoreline Boutique, which is like my new favorite. Like I'm obsessed with this shop. Um, and I also got one thing from Amazon, which I'm super excited about. So anyway, I want to show you the Shoreline Boutique stuff because it's super cute. And let's go ahead and get started. So I found Shoreline Boutique and it was just kind of like one of the greatest discoveries ever for me because it is so totally my style. Um, it's very like classy but still very like coastal as you can tell by Shoreline. Um, but yeah, anyway, I really love the clothes from there were these shorts and they are so cute because they have white anchors on them and they're navy. I love this color combination so much. It might be my favorite color combination. Um, but anyway, I just think these are so cute and they are literally so soft, you guys. So I wear these all the time and I really, really enjoy them and they are just so perfect for the summer weather, you know? You know? So after that, I got another pair of shorts and I think these are so cute. Sort of like an Aztec-y kind of print and it has little white piping on it and I think these are so cute again i absolutely love this turquoise color as most of you guys know um but yeah they are again just like a nice flowy short because all the shorts that i had were so constricting so i was looking for shorts that were very more on the flowy side and that you can kind of like run around in this next thing is a bathing suit and i think that it is like so cute um i love how like nautical but also it's got a little bit of a like american vibe which i am a huge fan of um and it has this really pretty big um, red bow on the front and then it has like these navy and white stripes which I really really like um, and then it also has it comes with like um, a detachable strap so you can wear it as a tube top kind of thing or you can have it as like a halter strap that kind of can go here which I like the uh, versatility in that and then the bottoms are so cute too because they have like a little red bow on the side and then on the back they have um, this nice ruching, ruching feature. The next thing is a maxi dress and it looks like this. Um, again, I was looking for flowy things and this kind of popped out to me with all of the colors. Um, so yeah, it's just kind of like a maxi. I'm definitely going to have to go and get it altered because I'm just a short person. That's what happens. Um, but I think once I get it altered, it'll fit so well and I'm really excited because it's like all this stuff is just really breezy and easy to like wear and I am just so done with being hot <laughs> because it is super hot in LA already and it's still March so I'm afraid for what the summer has in store for us here in Los Angeles. Next I got some earrings. Um, they're in this really pretty sort of like purpley gray shade and they have this gold outline to them. I don't have my ears pierced um, but the owner of the store was like oh we're gonna throw a few things in there and um, so I thought that was really cute and um, so yes sadly I can't wear these because I don't have my ears pierced but um, I'm sure I can find someone who are going who is going to love these in my sorority. And the last thing is this cute little pencil bag and it says I am very busy and I really like it because it reminds me of like something that Kate Spade would have and also because my pencil case is totally falling apart so ha perfect so right before I sat down to start filming I went to Target so I'm going to show you what I got from there so a lot of this stuff is just miscellaneous stuff that I needed um, I am actually going to Las Vegas this upcoming weekend because my one of my very best friends is turning 21 and her birthday is going to be celebrated out there um, so I also needed to grab some things for my travels so the first things I got are food related and for those of you who have been watching me for a while now um, I definitely am um, diagnosed with celiac so I cannot have wheat or gluten of any kind so I picked up some Lara bars um, because they are gluten free and the reason I got these ones um, is because they're not gonna melt or anything um, because I am going to Las Vegas like I said so I'm gonna need to bring stuff because when you're gluten free sometimes um, it can be hard to like find food. <laughs> I want to make sure that I have food to eat um, so I got them in apple pie and blueberry which these are so so good. I've never tried apple pie but blueberry is so yummy. The next thing I got is the Rimmel Scandalize Mascara in Retro Glam and in waterproof and the reason I got this is because obviously Las Vegas we're gonna be spending a lot of time by the pool um, and so I just want to make sure that my mascara doesn't run down my face in a very unattractive fashion so this is probably the only makeup I'll wear while I'm there so I figured I would just get some to put on my eyelashes and wake the face up a little bit the next thing I got was a foaming facial cleanser because I'm out and I needed some and I picked up this Neutrogena one it says a makeup remover and cleanser in one for refreshingly clean skin um, I have never tried this one before so I'm really excited it was only it was under five dollars so that's why I decided to 
go with this one. And then, of course, for those of you who know me, I picked up a two-pack of Burt's Bees. I absolutely love Burt's Bees, um, but I just like to make sure that I have enough with me all the time, especially because I'm going to Las Vegas, and I'm very, fr I just hate being dehydrated, you guys. Like, I hate it so much. I drink so much water, um, and so I am bringing this because part of what happens when you get dehydrated is your lips get very chapped, and Las Vegas is really hot, so I'm bringing these in order to avoid dehydration. I picked up some nail files. These were like 90-something cents for 15 emery boards, so you can't go wrong there. Um, my nails are absolutely atrocious right now, so I'm definitely going to need to um, give myself a nice manicure in the next few days. So the next thing I bought is a spray bottle, and I have this like harebrained scheme that I'm going to make a like hair mist with um, some of the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle, which I actually bought some of that too, um, and like some water I think I'm going to try, or maybe some olive oil or something. I'm going to research online and then make my own concoction. Um, and I'm going to put it in this spray bottle, so that way when I go to Las Vegas and we're out by the pool, I can just kind of spray it in my hair and hopefully um, I can avoid damaging my hair more than it's already damaged. So I'm hoping that that will, um, you know, help my hair to be revitalized and then I won't have to style it as much. Um, but we'll see because there's a really high chance that that could be a big fail. But you know, we'll find out. It'll be fun. So I bought the Aussie Three Minute Miracle and I'm just now realizing it says color, um, which I <laughs> don't have color treated hair, but you know, it's fine. Um, and I'm just going to try and use this. And then I also picked up some of my conditioner that I always use, which is the Pantene. So we're going to see if we can make like a nice concoction in the spray bottle with some water. And, you know, we'll find out. We'll find out if how it goes. I'll make a video if it works. And if it doesn't, I will just cry. But then I also picked up some women's shave gel. Ooh, ah, exciting. So that concludes what I got from Target. And then the last thing I got, I got from Amazon. And it is the... <gasps> gigantic donut pool float Ooh, ah! and the reason why I'm so excited about this is because I have wanted one of these for literally so long I think I saw one on tumblr like three years ago and I never forgot it and so I went online and I started looking at these in my sorority house and then we started to find that there were also pretzels and watermelons and lemons and ice cream sandwiches and pizza and you can buy pool floats in a bunch of different kinds of food and I was really tempted to buy all of them but I went with this one because I've wanted it for so long. Anyway, let me get let me know in the information bar below if you guys are interested in like a spring break sort of like um, like food and essentials video because I really want to make one and so if you want to see it let me know so that way I'll make it and you'll like it and we'll all be happy. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul, and I'll talk to you next time.